And welcome to a stadium that's always a pleasure to visit, this Villa Park. Park. Derek Ray and here in the commentary position, awesome. and I'm joined as always by Lee Dixon. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Aston Villa up against Arsenal. Yeah, thanks Derek. Great atmosphere here. The two sides, I'm sure, will set a quick tempo in this game. We get to watch for free. The players are chomping at the bit. I can't wait. Well, he has to be regarded always as a dangerous opponent, but what should we expect to see from him in this game, Lee? Well, he plays the game as if the ball's his own. He lends it to other players. He's the glue between the team, between the different departments of the team, and he links everything together. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4 2 3 1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4 5 1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Ben Leno stands between the posts. Thomas Partey starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch. And the starting role in attack is handed to Alex Lacazette. And now they get the ball rolling. And he saw the situation developing. Bukayo Saka. Holding now. Lacazette. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Thomas. A creative look about this. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. McGinn. Ollie Watkins. And he read it well. Partey has lost it. Traore. Chances on. And it goes! An early opening statement in this match. And look at the celebrations. Well, here's the replay, and as we see, it's a class ball through to split the defence. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Well, he's got to be delighted with his players. A big smile on his face. They've got the noses in front. They're in the lead. Well done. Arsenal restart the game then. And they have work to do as they try to wipe out that last goal. Thomas. Jacka with it. Gabriel, Granit Xhaka, holding, Thomas now, Granit Xhaka, Tierney, showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Granit Xhaka, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. He has time to play it over. Thomas. Bukayo Saka. 
Jacka with it. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Granite Jacka. And it might be. Jacka. Lacazette. Looking for the angle. Well, that is a defender's job to come to the rescue. A good looking move. Douglas Luiz. It's with Douglas Luiz. McGinn. Tyrone Mings. Villa have not seen too much of the ball, to be fair. But to their credit, they've been absolutely blistering on the counter-attack. They just sit back, hit you on the break, and it's really working for this team. Watkins. Top-class defending. And that puts them in position. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. John McGinn. Watkins. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Well, he had designs on a double, but the goalkeeper wasn't having it. Well, he did better than the first time, the goalkeeper. What a save that is. And over comes the corner. And you need your defender to take charge. Well, behind for another corner. Normally such a free-scoring, vigorous player, Alexandre Lacazette, but lacking something today, Lee. Yeah, really hasn't been able to carve out any opportunities today. Certainly hasn't tested the keeper much. We expect more from him, but you can see why they're struggling today. And now the delivery. It didn't happen for them. Fruitful-looking attack. Went in strongly to win the ball. Granite Jacka. McGinn. Now with Ross Barkley. Looks promising this. And they've won possession again. Lacazette and Obama Young now. Granite Jacka. Jacka. And that was a very fine read. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. John McGinn. Ollie Watkins. The first half here comes to an end. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. And now they get the ball rolling. Back underway with Arsenal trying to find a route back into the match. Holding. Granite Jacker. It's with Gabriel. Jacker with it. And Obama Young now. Thomas Jacka with it Granite Jacka Disappointing pass Barkley It's with Douglas Luiz 
Barkley. Here's Grealish. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Has someone to play it to. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. So making the substitution now. Played into the centre of the box. It comes to nothing in the end. Traore. Douglas Luiz. It's with Douglas Luiz, Barclay. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Applying vigorous pressure. Barclay. McGinn. An attack full of promise. And I must say, that was a very promising attack. The alarm bells were sounding. Arsenal completely controlling possession, but it's just whether they can convert that possession into clear-cut chances. You sense they need to pick up the pace a little, start utilising the wide areas more. The back line's doing a decent job. Hopefully the forwards can do that as well. McGinn. Grealish. Options in the centre. Ollie Watkins. John McGinn. Barkley. Now the attack fizzled out. Arsenal get the advantage from the referee. Lacazette. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Oh, he's really opened them up here, and it's gone in, beyond the goalkeeper, Arsenal level. Well, Derek, that tells you all you need to know about this group of players. Great team spirit, fantastic stuff. Well, here's the replay. It's lovely interplay between the two of them, and then through on goal. Do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Even Steven won a piece on this match. 15 minutes remaining. John McGinn. Grealish. Barkley. John McGinn. Can they push ahead on the closing stages? Well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. Cash. Consa. Pure ball control. Barkley. It's with Douglas Luis. We're getting the ball forward. Consa. And it's a case of just five minutes left. Thomas 
Arsenal remain on the front foot. Can they find a winning goal? Masterful piece of foiling. Real chance. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, I think the players realise what they owe this coach. Lovely sight to see them celebrating with him. Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely, quick counter-attack that sets up the chance. And then the brute force and guile in equal amounts sets up the chance to score. And he doesn't disappoint, does he? Well, the coach has to be happy with that. Got their noses in front. Still work to be done, though. Well, having fallen behind, the onus is on Arsenal to come up with an articulate response. And there goes the whistle for full time. The Villa fans will leave the stadium happy on the back of this victory lead. Yeah, well, it could really have gone either way. It was so competitive for much of the game, but they just kept pushing. They kept believing and probably deserved the winner in the end. Great result. And I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well, looked really sharp, constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real handful.